I was looking at what's going on in Washington these days, and now I see, uh, you know, a lot of these gay Republicans are being outed. Uh, this Larry Craig character from Idaho. Do you know, you must have met him at least. What does your gaydar tell you about him? I, I actually served in the house with him, and my uh, sense tells me to just shut up. <laughs> But, but didn't the GOP bring this on themselves? What? Well, bring what on? Well, the fact that there are gay Republicans, is that a crime? No, but they made... <laughs> it would be if the Republicans had their way. <laughs> <laughs> Excuse me. I mean, literally. Excuse me. Same intimacy, physical intimacy between people of the same sex was a crime in the state of Texas. Governor George Bush yeah. said it should remain a crime. The United States Supreme Court said no, intimacy between consenting adults of the same sex should not be a crime. Scalia dissented. He got very angry. Thomas dissented. Rehnquist dissented. My guess is Roberts and Aliota were now on that side. As a matter of fact, if John Paul Stevens, who's 85, leaves the court for some reason, and I hope obviously not, and the, uh, George Bush gets to make another appointment, you will get a five-member majority that would reverse that. So, in fact, the Republicans did believe that... Uh, this was a crime. Rick Santorum, a great Republican conservative leader, said when that opinion came out, well, that's like allowing man-on-dog sex. I mean, so the fact is, yes, the Republicans do think it should be a crime, and I think there's a right to privacy, but the right to privacy should not be a right to hypocrisy. And people who want to demonize other people shouldn't then be able to go home and close the door and do it themselves. Uh, <laughs> so I'm all for, for a right to privacy, but I'm also a right to keep your own money. And but liberals so want to... You want to change the you, subject, Steve. No, that you just want to no, change the subject. You can't stand no, the fact... You're changing the subject. You can't, you're changing you can't the subject. He the asked the question... That a lot of gays actually subscribe to the no, Republican philosophy No, that is not true. Government. Steve, you have put more bad thoughts in my head that were never there. <laughs> I have enough. I'm trying to educate you. No, no, you're not. You keep saying, I think this and I think that. That's the kind of distortion your side has been engaging in for too long. I don't think any of the nonsense you're trying to impute to me. My objective, if people want to say, look, I'm gay, but I think my dignity as a gay man is much less important than uh, being able to make war in Iraq and ignore global warming, good luck to you. Just don't claim that you're doing this to advance gay rights. And don't, if you are going to be yourselves and practicing gay man, then vote for and help candidates who would make what you do illegal. If you want to have an economic view, okay. But the hypocrisy of this, these gay Republicans who make the lives of others... Look, you know, there are 15-year-olds in this country today in high school whose lives are being made miserable because they're gay or lesbian. And people who are themselves gay adults who are enjoying positions of power in Washington who advance that kind of abusive society... No, it has nothing to do with their economics. I find that contemptible. that it's not a slippery slope to man on dog sex, as Rick Santorum No, says. look, I don't subscribe to that. As the that, dog comes in in the morning and starts licking your penis and then <laughs> the you only have to decide whether to stop him or not. Do and I, I don't know where that... A lot of gays do subscribe to the Republican philosophy of strong defense, limited government, low I taxes. I understand that. And you know what? Most Americans agree with what you said, but they still don't want gay marriage. You know, they don't think that they think that debases the You are the really idea good what... at changing the subject. Um, no, but I mean, I mean this is what the gay about, agenda is about. We weren't talking about gay marriage. What I said specifically was, and you looked as if you were about to disagree, that they don't think it should be a crime.